Hello. Today we're going to talk about the Note Organizer module in the Take Charge software suite. All of you uh, have probably seen the different Note programs that are out there for Windows. But you got Notepad from Windows. Uh, you have Sticky Notes. You have Desktop Notes. Uh, you have Notepad Plus. I mean, they're just more than you can talk about. Um, and they all have the same basic flaw, however, and that is is that there's no simple way to organize your notes so that you remember that you wrote yourself a note or a reminder. So in our system, what we've done is we've taken added notes to our menu system. So now here, when you bring up the menu, you're at your first page, and there's a note organizer module. I can select it here and then click open, or I can hit the direct access button in the toolbar. We're going to do that. Now what gets displayed is notes by books. Every time you create a note, it, you're going to assign it to a book, and you get to create those book names. It's whatever you want them to be. These happen to be ones that I created. So I'm going to take and click on help and open it. And here's all the notes or files that I've created for help for the Take Charge software suite. If I want to open one, I select it, and I go ahead and click uh, open. And there it is. Now what? this is our note writer or our quick note reminder. And as you can see, it's a nice, neat little form. Once it's up, I can print it if I want to have a travel copy. I can link it to a contact if it's a note that's specific to a friend or a contact. I can take and uh, change the formatting of it, because unlike a normal note file, it's a rich text, so you can do all kinds of formatting to make it look a lot prettier. I can convert the note to three different modules within the application. I can change it to a to-do, a journal entry, or an email. We'll talk about those in a minute. If I want to export this note, I click on the export as, and one simple dialog gives me a tremendous amount of options. I can send it out as a PDF file, a rich text file, a plain text file, a batch file, a Windows script file, an HTML file, or an HTML file. I can set the folder that I want to store it in so that it's easily found when I want to go back and retrieve it or if I want to point to it from another application. I can change the name to make it something simple for me to remember. When I do the export, I can tell it that I want it to be just a current note that I have displayed or all notes in a category. So in this particular case, it's either the single help file or all the help files we have written for the Take Charge Suite. I can save the export, I can save it and then print it, or I can save it and then email it, all from this one simple dialog. Very simple. Now, if I want to attach it, it'll convert it to a PDF file and send it as an attachment, pop up the email writer, and all I have to do is fill in the body and then take and uh, select the person I want to send it to, and away it goes. Um, now, let's go ahead and look at some of the other features in the software. On the action buttons, you have Open Note Organizer, which we'll get to in a minute, Quick Note, Show books. So like if I want to go back to my book screen, I can do that. And let's get back over here. Um, I can delete and e a reminder. And I can send it as an email attachment right from this screen. Okay, now a quick note takes and brings up the note screen and it's blank. What it does, it assigns it to the book for quick notes. And then it uh, stamps a date and a time for it. So let's create a note. Simple note, hello. And I want to convert this note. Now, if I convert it to an email, that word hello would become the body of the email, and the subject would be the date and time that you see right there. Um, then all I have to do is pick the client and send it. So it's an easy way to write emails without having to go through the steps of opening the email module, checking to see if there's any current mail. You simply write your note, uh, convert it to an email, select your client, and away it goes. On a to-do, that's the one we're going to do, uh, it takes and creates the to-do, and all I have to do now is assign a new date for it. So there you go. I want to be reminded on the 30th that I have an appointment, and I can reset the time, but 3.30 is good. I can say that I have, I need an hour to get it done. I can give it a short title, and then I've got the body, which I can enhance at this time or leave it the way it is. I can link it up to a group for easier viewing and organizing. And I can take and uh, link it to a contact 
so that now if I go to the contact screen I can see all my notes and activities for that contact very simple I can set it so that it's reoccurring and it would reoccur by either day week or month and I can um, save it um, and that's pretty much it so let's just save it and we'll close this screen so that to do is now done all right now let's look at the node organizer here in the actual module for the node organizer you have some more features here's a note we just created it just says hello um, now over here I have all the books so I can select a book let's select help again and then down here under groups under help I would have various groups but I only have one and I have several chapters and pages so I can just click on them, change them, edit them, print them, uh, export them, save them as different file formats, anything I want to do um, also, I can take and create a new note from this screen, or I can import from a file. So let's say you currently have a lot of note files or text files on your machine, or other note or text programs, and you're tired of using them. Well, now you can import those directly into the Take Charge Note Organizer, assign a proper date for them, and they'll be nice and organized and easy for you to find for future reference. And most important, your desktop screen will be as clean and as pretty, reflecting the images that you want to see on it. That's it for today. I hope you find this module useful. And as always, if you need any help with any programs or development, one of the things that we do at Take Charge Software is custom programming. Thanks a lot and have a great day.